Okay. It's World Poetry Day was this week, and for most of us, the power of poems comes from the lyrical language. But for poet Nick Degg, the location for his performance is equally as important. Yeah, he favours some pretty unusual venues and has just begun a tour where he'll perform in a retirement village and even a boarding kennels alongside cafes and pubs. Well, Nick has penned a special poem all about his love of the spoken word. Poetry is a bacon butty when nothing else will do. Poetry is a cup of tea when you're gasping for a brew. Poetry is fresh and clean like a newly ironed shirt. Poetry is a vacuum cleaner sucking up the dirt. Poetry is a wheelbarrow when you need to move some rubble. Poetry is a telescope. Poetry is the hubble. Poetry is an overcoat. Poetry is a shoe. Poetry is someone's lips saying, I love you. Poetry is a vehicle, the words are the fuel. It can take you into space or even back to school. Poetry is read by cows wearing scarves of silk. Poetry is unconventional, sometimes it doesn't rhyme. Poetry is a handshake or a hug from a friend. Poetry is conversations you hope will never end. Poetry is about honesty and very rarely doubt. Poetry is an angler's smile when he's caught a ten-pound trout. Poetry is a hot cross bun with lashings of best butter. Poetry is a wardrobe that gets rid of the clutter. Poetry uses metaphors to get the point across. Poetry is both heads and tails, so it always wins the toss. Poetry is your holiday train waiting at the station. Poetry can be anything if you've got an imagination.